Gleb. I asked this of Kate last week. I'm going to ask it of you. Who are you? Oh, my God. Really? I don't know who I am. I don't know. Wow. Carrie Ann. Can I just say how much I love Halloween? I, I mean, know. this is incredible. Okay. That, okay, you slipped right there. But what you did with that slip is what blew me away. You were so in character, you were so trusting of Gleb that you just went with it. You made it a moment. You saw when she did the drag yeah, and she went yeah, to her knees. It yeah. was so powerful. Your core is getting so strong. And what I see with you is true transformation. You are evolving as a dancer every minute, every day. It's amazing. Glenn. I'm not sure what Lola wants, but I saw plenty of what Lenny wants. Yes! <laughs> you were so full of Argentine characterization. I thought that was wonderful. It was such a spirited performance. I thought the two of you sparked off of each other hey. and it was a, <laughs> a terrific number. Well done. By the way, Gleb, that defying gravity move was pretty I cool know. on your part too. Good can I have a bite, please? Oh, oh deadly sexy, <laughs> irresistible vampire bombshell. <laughs> Apart from, the, as Len said, the sequence of ganchos you did were exquisite, but your performance, at times it was like watching if Marilyn Monroe was a vampire doing an Argentine <laughs> tango. Yes. That's what it would how, look like. How about that for a high praise? of tough Madonna in there. There you go. To give us girl power. Brilliant. A Marilyn Madonna vampire. Go get some good scores over there at the Star Lounge. If you want to compete for the mirror ball without all the sticky spray tan, play Dancing with the Stars, the official game, free wherever you download your mobile app. Aaron. Get over here, you Marilyn Monroe vampire. Um, Carrie Ann says your core is strong, but what Carrie Ann doesn't know is you have a messed up rib, right? Tell us about it. I have three. What happened? Ribs. On the right side and one on the other side. Yeah, Just I have one. The... Dr. Gleb, by the way, no, I'm kidding. I have four heart ribs. So what happened? When she said my core looked strong, I looked straight at Gleb because all I've been trying to do is pretend like my ribs aren't broken <laughs> for this whole competition. Are they broken? Um, oh. I fractured the one on the left the first week of the show. And um, I haven't had this, these x-rayed, but they don't feel great. <laughs> I will tell you, they look strong, but from somebody who does football, that is one of the most painful injuries. When your ribs are broken, that is no joke. What does that say about this girl? She's so strong, I'm so yeah. proud that she got through it. She, we had a tough week, and I'm really proud of you. You did a great job. That's amazing, go easy, go easy. Let's get your scores. Ariane Inaba. Nine! Len Goodman. Nine! Bruno Tognoni. Nine! 27 out of 30 for Lauren and Gleb so far. That's your first nine from Len, by the way, so far of this season. And now we have a four-way tie at the top. Of course, they'll be back on the floor for the team dances. You can text and vote for them on abc.com. Go rest those ribs, babe. Tom? I bet some of the other couples are breaking their own ribs backstage right now. <laughs> the cavalcade of creepy costumes continues. Say that five times fast with last week's leaderboard bookend. John and Lindsay and Kate and Pasha will post this week's individual scores before the team dance round live. You your phone? No. No? It's outside. Okay, just be quiet. Just be quiet. Did you hear that? It's an old house. It creaks. Does an old house do that too? I think it was a message from Lucy. What do you think killed her? You can't keep doing stuff like this. I want like this. the truth. Can you think of any spirits that you pissed off lately? What do you want? <laughs>